New at 11, many in the community are upset about a children's business suddenly shutting down. Yeah, we told you about bouncies closing last night at 10, but tonight many are now stepping up to help. Depending your size, Liz Palka has been working on the other side of the story tonight. Liz? Tom and Nicole, we have had a strong response from this story. Many are saying they had party reservations at Bouncy's and they're not sure what to do next, while we're finding other businesses are stepping up to help. And I just knew that I had something that I could provide them and help them out with, possibly. Kim Teixeira is one of multiple Hampton Roads business imagine? owners saying we can help. She owns Sylvan Learning in Chesapeake. I just know how sad I would be if I had planned something and then knew I'd put all this money into it and now it's lost. Teixeira saw a 10 on your side story on bouncies in Virginia Beach. The inflatable party center suddenly shut down last week. Multiple parents tell us they had children's birthday parties scheduled for the next days and weeks and didn't know the business was closing. Plus, they had already paid for daily deals and deposits. The building's landlord says Bouncy's owner, Brandy Thompson, and her husband were a few months behind on rent. Then they walked out. Kate Lee is one of the parents affected. I think it's almost more upsetting just that they were selling coupons a month out if they already knew they were behind on the rent. Since our story aired, many in the community have responded. The story on Facebook has hundreds of comments and more than a thousand shares. The owner of the Bounce House, another inflatable center with locations across Hampton Roads, said he'll help out. Andy Howard said he will honor any deposits lost at Bouncy's. He added he'll accept daily deals like the recent Groupon for the closed Bounce Center. Teixeira saw our story too and said any child who is willing to forgo a moon bounce could have a robotics party at Sylvan. She'll make room for you and your child's party. So if they paid for a deposit, don't worry about it with me. We'll get them in here. We'll put a party together. We'll work it out. I don't want anything to stop them from having a party for their little one. I have been told by multiple sources that the owners of Bouncies are opening up a new business in Virginia Beach. We are working to confirm more details on this. and When we have more information, we'll update this story. I'm Liz Palka, 10 on your side. And we could not reach the Bouncies owners directly, and our calls to their attorney have not been returned.